Hi, and welcome to Simply Pamela, where we're what? Simply fabulous. If this is your first time here, I'd like to say welcome, welcome. And to all my return subscribers, I'd like to say, hey girl, so glad you came back to see me. All right, so in this video, I'm just kind of giving you my weekly wardrobe, things I have worn or would wear just during a regular week in my life. And I really want to show just the full gamut. I want to show neutrals because some people really like neutrals. That's why they, they feel comfortable. And then I want to show how you can just gradually add color because some people absolutely love color. So what can I do in my weekly wardrobe? So hopefully this uh, video will give you some inspiration in your wardrobe. And one of the things I am going to focus on are, are more natural fibers. Not everything that I have is going to be a natural fiber. But for example, what I have on today, both pieces are linen blends. Now, some people absolutely love linen, especially for the spring and summer, because it's a breathable, natural fabric, but it does wrinkle. So sometimes that's why people stay away from that. But I absolutely love linen. I just like how it feels and I just like how it's, it's breathable. So it's easy breezy for the summertime. So these two pieces both came from Ross, but, you know, just whatever linen piece you have will work. Just think about using linen in your wardrobe for the summer. Uh, the skirt, I just really like. Now, it had its own belt that it came with. You've seen the skirt before. But I didn't like the belt because it's made out of the same fabric. And this linen blend is is thinner. So the belt would be twisted up. Mm -mm, I, I couldn't do that. So I did find a white belt. Remember y'all I was talking about a white belt? I did find one. I don't absolutely love it. This one came from Amazon. Uh, so if you, I can link it below. But like I said, I don't absolutely love it, but it works. It works. So I have the white belt that I got from Amazon. Again, the top, this cocoa colored top, linen blend top. It came from Ross as well. Uh, cream, cream colored skirt, Ross. And then for my shoes, the shoes, you've seen these before too. These actually came, they're Vince Camuto shoe that I got several years ago at a Vince Camuto uh, outlet. We were in New Jersey and uh, I got the shoes there. But I just really like it because you all know I love something that wraps around the leg, around the ankle or around the leg. So that's where I got this. And I just thought it looked really nice with the uh, outfit. So like the shoes. And then I just added my accessories, my bag. I really like because, you know, this macrame for the summer is just really nice. And then the tortoise kind of tortoise shell handles really like that. That came from Ross as well. And then just added my jewelry. So my necklace. I love the, the bees. They just kind of work really well with this cocoa brown uh, top. And then just added the earrings and the earrings just came with the necklace, girl. Most of the time, I don't even use those, but this worked well with this. So that's why I did that. And then my bracelet that you've seen before, and that just worked perfectly, perfectly because it has the brown and the cream in it. And then my brown ring that you've seen before. And then I added the hat, and the hat worked so well with the two. Now, the hat, I can link to because the hat came from Walmart. I just happened to be in Walmart getting stuff and let's say, let me just run through the hats right quick. Actually, I was looking for a white belt there. But let us say, let me run through the hats. And I found this hat and I thought, oh, this is too cute. And I don't have one that's dark like this. So it worked so well with the outfit. And then I just topped it off with my brown shades. So how do you think this outfit turned out? So I'm, I'm rocking my linen and it is neutral. So for those who I don't do a whole lot of color, I don't like it like that. What do you think of this look? All righty, so I will be right back. I'm just going to change a couple of things and show you how just with the skirt, you can add a little bit more color. Be right back. All righty, ladies, so I am back with the next look. And all I did this time was just added a little color to the outfit. So I added this linen blend blue uh, shirt that I got from a uh, blue button down that I got from Ross. I like because it has the V-neck. I like that it has the two pockets on the front. And again, it's the linen blend, so it's very breathable. But see how I just added a little bit of color. So if you don't like color, you like neutrals, this is a way to add just a little bit of color into your wardrobe or into your look. And I just accessorized by adding my um, Dolce Vita shoes. You saw these before in another uh, video. So the shoes actually came from DSW. So hopefully you're getting a close look at the shoes. And um, so I really like these because they are comfortable. 
And I can link these because they are at DSW. So if they are available, I'll try to link those in the description box below. So really like that. And I added my anklet too with that. So always try to add your anklet regardless. And then I just accessorized with the purse. I really like this purse because I like how it has the wicker. And then it's like a linen material on there too. So I really like that. So it just kind of goes really well with the skirt, adding some texture with that wicker. And then I just added my bracelet and I got that from a um, little consignment shop in my area. Added my hat. Where did the hat come from? I want to say Ross, but I can't really remember. But I like I like the fact that it's straw because I love a straw hat. And I like because it has a little beading on it and the beading has blue in it. So I thought it coordinated with the outfit really well. I added a bold earring. So see, this is bold and, and the earring has the blue in it. So I really like that. And then I'm just going to top it off with my blue shades. So just in subtle ways, just adding color with my jewelry, with my shades. So if that's something you don't feel comfortable in a lot of color, this is a way to just gradually add just a little bit of color in your outfit. So I really like how this one turned out as well. So tell me, what do you think of look number two? Just by changing up the shirt, it just kind of changed the whole look of the outfit. Or well, change up the whole look. What do you think? All righty, ladies, I will be back with another look. All righty, ladies, so I am back with another look. So this look, I have added more color into the look. So I've added the skirt. Now, you've seen the skirt before. I got it from Goodwill. I just really like it because it's just so ladylike, so girly. I like how it balloons out. Uh, and this time I'm adding with my shoes. I added a neutral shoe because I want to show you how you can just gradually add color into your wardrobe. Uh, if, if that's something that's an issue for you. And if you like color, this just gives you some more inspiration. So the shoe is a neutral shoe. I like the gold heel. You've seen this one before. This one came from City Trends. I um, kept my anklet on that I had with the other outfit, but then I added another anklet and this one has the cream in it. So I really like that. I thought that was cute. So yeah, you can wear two anklets, one on each if you like. So I really like the shoes, thought that was cute. And I love this um, skirt. I know it was homemade. Somebody homemade this skirt and I don't know what happened, but it worked out good for me because now I got it. And I like because it has pockets you know, love a pocket. And I added this neutral color top that I got from Ross. Just really like it. And I was trying to remember if I can remember the uh, material. I think this is a, um, this may be a, I can't remember if it's a linen blend or not, but it is a breathable material because it is thin. It is very breathe breathable. So very good for the summer. Very good for the summer. And I like how I try to coordinate because it's got that, tan kind of color and it coordinates with the tan flowers in the skirt. So even though I'm adding that color, you still coordinate your colors together. So I really like that. And then I just added my uh, jewelry and I did pink bracelets to coordinate with the uh, skirt. And then that bracelet has the pink and brown in it. And then my earrings, just a big pink hoop. So I like those. And then I'm mixing my prints because I added the hat, the straw hat that has the animal print uh, pink bandana around it. So just a subtle way mixing those prints. And then I mixed again here with my purse that has the tan and white stripes. So again, let's we'll see how that coordinates all well together. And then I topped it off with my tan shades. And I like these because I like because they're big and they're square. So I really like how these look on my face. So I really like how this outfit turned out. So I'm adding color. So I got a bold color on the bottom, but then that's it. Everything else is neutral. So it doesn't seem like it's overwhelming you. But I really like how this turned out. What about you? What do you think about this look? Alrighty, ladies, I will be back with another look. 
Alrighty, ladies, so I am back with the next look. And this time I am adding more color into my look. And I'm doing trying to do it subtly. So I added this bright orange top that I absolutely love. It's sleeveless. This came from Ross as well. But I just love because it just screams summer to me. And I added it with these flowy pants. Now, these pants are actually rayon, but they're very uh, light and flowy, flowy and very breathable. So a thin material. Uh, so I really like these. They have pockets. You've seen them before. I had them on, had them on in a couple of videos back, but I styled them differently because, you know, we want to get the most from our wardrobe. So I'm styling them a different way, but I really like them. They are very long, but, you know, I'm only five, one and a half. So I have to wear a heel when I wear these or get them hem. So I just prefer to wear a heel. The shoes that I picked this time are ones that I got from DD. So I like because of the color and I like that. Um, the heel on them, I like it's platform and the heel is almost like a raffia, not exactly, but I like that. So that just makes me think of summertime and they work well with the pants because now as long as I have a heel on, I don't have to get a hem. So really like this. This look just makes me think of vacation, like I'm about to go on vacation. We're about to go out to eat. And so this is what I'm going to have on. So I really like this. And I kept my uh, some of my accessories neutral. So the purse. That came from Ross as well. I like how it has the different neutrals in it, but it coordinates well with the pants. See how that looks together? And then I added some bright jewelry. So I added my orange bracelet that's bright. And I added my orange ring that's bright. But then this ring is more muted. So I tried to mix that up. And then I have my big earrings that are white. Love these earrings. So with these, you don't need a necklace or anything. The earrings just say everything. And then I added my headband. And it is the pearl headband. And I wear my headbands like a tiara. Because I, I found that you're supposed to wear your headband back on your head. I'm like, mm -mm, my headbands are tiaras for me. So that's why it's more to the front. So love it. And then I'm going to top it off with my shades. And if you see, the shades have little pearls on them right there. Isn't that cute? I just thought that was too cute. So just added my shades. So what do you think of this? So with this outfit, the pants do have a little color. So just easing your way into color. But then I have a bold color at the top. Remember the last outfit, I had the bold at the bottom. This time I switched it to the top. And I think it turned out well, just like the other one. What do you think of this look? Just easy breezy. Alrighty, ladies, I will be back with the last look and it's bold color. I'll be right back. Alrighty, ladies, so I am back with the last look and what do you think of this bold color? I'm absolutely loving it. You know, after I'm making this video, I'm thinking to myself, you know, this is almost like a vacation lookbook, really, for me anyway. But this is something I would definitely wear on vacation. Now, I may would change the shoes and put on something that's flat if I'm out during the day. But if I was going out at night for dinner, I would absolutely wear this outfit. So let's get into it. So the dress is 100 percent cotton. So, you know, thinking about natural fibers, thinking about things that are going to be breathable. This is going to be perfect for the summer. 100 percent cotton. Now, you know, of course, it will shrink. So you have to just watch it, watch it when you wash it or when you dry it, rather. Uh, so I love the color in this. This came from Ross. I also I love the sleeve. So that's a point of interest for the dress. And I like the fact that you can wear it on the shoulder like I have here. Or if you like, you can do like this. And then just do an off the shoulder look. So then this is even more for vacation. So just whatever way you prefer, on the shoulder or off the shoulder. I like both. And then let's go down to the shoes. So the dress came from Ross and then the shoes. I think I'm not sure if you saw these before yet or not. Love these. These are a Goodwill find. They are a platform. So they are very easy to walk in. Now, after I have them on for a while, they do start to get uncomfortable. But I do have to have them on for a while before that happens. But absolutely love this shoe. You can't beat it at the Goodwill. I'm like, what? yes. And I added my anklets on both. This one has the pink one on it. And this one has a little red on it. I don't know if you can see the 
I think it's turned the wrong way. There you go. So you can see the little red on the anklet there. So love that. So love the shoes. Love how they coordinate with the dress. And then I just added minimal jewelry. I added my red bracelet. And then check out these earrings, lady, I, ladies. I love my heart earrings. I think they are so cute. So with that, again, I feel like I don't need a necklace, even if I wear it off the shoulder, because the earrings say everything. And I added my purse. Now, this purse, <clears throat> I can link this one. <laughs> this one actually came from Walmart. So I saw what I wanted was the hot pink one. Oh, that's the one I really wanted. But they didn't have it in the large size. They had the pink, but it was a smaller one. And, you know, I'm a big bad girl. So but they had the red and I didn't have a red straw bag. And I really like how this looks. So got the red one. So I will link that in the bottom if you're interested in that. Really, really cute. Works so well with the outfit. Then I added my hat. You know, this is one of my most favorite hats. And I like, again, because it coordinates with the dress, because the hat has the red and the pink line around it. And the dress has the pink and the red in it. So try to coordinate that in my outfit. So absolutely love this one. What do you think? Do you love it too? Whether it's on the shoulder or off. So let's bring it back up on the shoulder. See, it just gives it a different look. So think about things like that. You may have something in your wardrobe that you always wear off the shoulder. Can you wear it on the shoulder or vice versa? Do you always wear it on the shoulder? Can you wear it off the shoulder? That gives you another look. Makes you, It allows you to get more out of your wardrobe. So I hope I have inspired you in this video to try more color. I hope I've inspired you to try different fibers, different fabrics, especially for the summertime, thinking about cotton and linen. If you haven't tried those, if you think of oh, linen and wrinkles, try it anyway, and you may actually love it. So I enjoyed making this video for you today. I hope you enjoyed it too. If you did, then make sure you like, you comment, and you subscribe. Also, make sure you share the video because we're really trying to grow the Simply Pamela family. All righty, till next time. Bye.